To manage driver's logs, come down here to Activity, HOS, Duty Status Logs. Choose the date range and driver and click Apply Changes. We can now see the logs for the driver for the date range that we chose. The standard display here has the date in blue across the top of each day's logs. Each day goes from midnight to midnight with the most recent log on the top. So if you want to see the first log of the day, you have to scroll to the bottom. If you like having these in reverse, so the earliest log is at the top, scroll up and click the sort by button. This will put the earliest date at the top and order the logs from earliest to latest. We'll switch this back to the standard view for now, since this is what most people use. Here's a log for the 30th. Scrolling to the bottom, we can see that the driver was off from midnight for 6 hours and 17 minutes until starting his pre-trip inspection at 6.17 a.m. We can see that the inspection lasted 19 minutes and 22 seconds and that our driver was logged in to the box truck. At 6.36, he drove for 15 minutes and 34 seconds and covered a distance of 4 miles. He drove a little more later that afternoon was on, drove again a couple of times in the evening, and was on again for the rest of the night. If you're more of a visual person, you can get a pretty good idea of the driver's day in this view graph area at the top of each day's logs. Here we can see the same thing on the graph as we saw in the logs, an off status until the pre-trip, that short four mile drive, a long time on, the drive in the afternoon, and those two in the evening. Gray means the logs are unverified, yellow means that the logs were edited, and haven't been verified yet. This pencil icon also indicates when a log has been edited. Verified logs have this check mark and show up in green on the graph. So when our driver verifies this day's logs, they'll show up in green too. Here's what they look like. As you can see, the pencil icon is still there to show that the logs were edited, but we also have the check mark to show that they were verified. Now you may be looking at this and asking a very valid question. Why aren't we seeing any violations? This driver was on for well over his 14 hour window and something should be showing up. He never took his break or anything else. The short answer is I kept the violations turned off just to keep this demonstration simpler. I'll be covering violations and how to fix those in the next video.